Alright, hey guys, it's Bunnyhead Kid, and, um, so I was playing some, uh, Real Flight today, and, uh, Real Flight G5.5, and, um, this switch fell back into the receiver. So, what I did was, I unscrewed the back, there's four screws, two up top and two on the bottom, just took the back off, and so this is the inside of it. And, um, so yeah, you can see it, it's, uh, right here, and, so yeah, you just put it back into its little slot, and then, it's kind of hard to see, I just found it, so yeah, you just put it in there, I'm actually not sure which way I put it in, I'm guessing it goes this way, because, the wires bend that way. Oh wait, no. I can just... Why don't I just uh, test it out on this plane? Like this F-18. I guess I gotta... Uh, yeah. Alright, so that's on the right way. Sorry about that. Um, so then, yeah, there's this little piece. What? Okay. Um, so yeah, there's... Okay. So, this little piece. Um, sorry, I'm not getting filming. There's a little screw. Like, that's on the other one down there. But it came off. So all you gotta do is just screw it back on. Um, let me just make sure the switch is in the position. Okay, it's in. And then if I screw this on, it should stay put. Alright, so, yep. There we go. I just, uh, screwed it back on there, so now it's Fully functioning and working again, like uh, on this F-18, the dual rate switch, it turns on the smoke, so yep, it's working. Alright, so that's that, I'm just gonna screw the back on now, and uh, yep, that's how it works, so bye.